As always, Howard's homecoming brought the celebrities out in mass, but it was a Morgan State running back who really put on a show. Another season, another homecoming, another overtime thriller. I'm Mark Gray, and the Beltway Sports Report is next. Terrence Howard, Diddy, and Keisha Knight Pulliam were part of the standing room only crowd at Green Stadium for Howard's Homecoming 2008. But the real star of this show was Morgan State's Devin James, who had a career day. 219 yards and two touchdowns, and the Bears would need every one of them. The top rated defense in the FCS subdivision put the clamps on the MEAC's best passing attack, holding Howard to just 208 yards. But Howard's aerial attack found its rhythm when Floyd Hagler connected with Arlanda's Hood for a 20 yard score. Then freshman sensation Willie Carter hauls in his sixth touchdown catch in as many games, and Howard grabs a 14 10 lead in the third quarter. It would stay that way till the fourth when James then gives the Bears the lead by doing what he does, taking it to the house from 32 yards out to make it a 17 14 game. Then, after Morgan botches a fake punt where they could have iced the game, Howard forces overtime as Patrick Wolf's 21-yard field goal, the first of his career, splits the uprights to tie things up at 17 at the end of regulation. First overtime, Hagler finds Daly Gunter for 11 yards to put Howard up. Then, James comes right back from four yards out, and we're tied at 24. Second overtime, Bears get the ball first. And Keith Lee scores from three yards out, 31-24 Morgan. But Howard comes right back when Hagler finds running back Ray Ray McCathrick Bay. But Wolf's extra point hits the upright. Elation for Morgan. Heartache for Howard as the Bears win their third straight in overtime over the Bison, 31-30. I'm Mark Gray, and that's the Beltway Sports Report for Sports Groove TV.